1973 National 500 from Wikipedia, the free encyclopedia. The 1973 National 500 was a NASCAR Winston Cup Series racing event that took place on October the 7th, 1973 at Charlotte Motor Speedway in the American community of Concord, North Carolina. Temperatures for the race would vary between 53.1 degrees Fahrenheit, 11.7 degrees Celsius, and 75.9 degrees Fahrenheit, 24.4 degrees Celsius, with 63.6 degrees Fahrenheit, 17.6 degrees Celsius, being the average temperature. Subsection Summary 334 laps took place on a paved track spanning 1,500 miles, 2,414 kilometres, with two cautions giving out for 16 laps. However, the race took 3 hours and 26 minutes to finish, with Cale Yarborough defeating Richard Petty by a time of 1.4 seconds. Yarborough and Petty would lap the field three times before retrieving the chequered flag. David Pearson won the official pole position with a speed of 158.315 miles per hour, 254.783 kilometres an hour, which was equivalent to 34.109 seconds. 64,000 people attended this live racing event. Among the other drivers who finished in the top 10 were Bobby Allison, Benny Parsons, Dickie Trickle, Lenny Pond, Buddy Arrington, Elmo Langley, Cecil Gording and Henley Gray. Harry Gant would make his racing debut here, ultimately finishing in 11th place. Wendell Scott would retire after this race making a 12th place finish in this event. Buddy Baker would become the last place finisher here due to a disqualification on lap 228. What made this race extra important to drivers? That $100 was given out for every lap that a driver led, $494.21 in today's money. Yarborough and Petty were said to have engines in their cars that exceeded the horsepower permitted by NASCAR during that era. Bobby Allison filed a complaint with Bill France Jr which resulted in a six-hour meeting and satisfactory restitution.